Okay, so uh, without further ado, we'll go ahead and get to clamping this thing and the challenges that a fully flat ground blade present. Uh, I've got a little trick here that I learned. Is on the inside of my clamp, I just put a little bit of double-sided foam tape. And I'm just talking about the really cheap stuff you pick up at the grocery store for hanging posters and things. It's just a double-sided sticky foam tape. And I cut off two little squares and I stick them on the inside of my vise like this. Uh, normally I run them across the whole width of the vise, but because this knife tapers all the way down the length of it, I've just put them on the front half there. And um, basically what, it's, what the tape is doing is it's filling in the voids and allowing me to get a really nice vertical clamp on the knife and hold it really well. So, I put the tape on, I just reassemble this, which just takes a moment. And then the next thing in clamping a fully flat ground blade is I want to start with the bottom of the vise opened to the width of the knife. So I just insert the knife, make sure it's at least open as wide as the, the thickness of the spine. Now because this knife is a little bit over an inch from spine to edge, I'm going to use the lower holes in the vise here. And I'm going to just plug my vise key or my depth key, excuse me, into the alignment guide and slide that in. And then I'm going to slide the knife forward to position B, just like this. And I'm going to snug up the top, and then I'll just put a little pressure to clamp it on the bottom. And what I want to verify now, and I'm going to use this angle cue to do it, is that I'm getting the same angle on the left and the right sides of the, of the knife and make sure that the tape is doing what it's supposed to do. So I just set this on here, lay it against this knife, and I read it, and we are at 15.25 degrees on this side, and then I can just come over to the other side, do the exact same thing, and we are at 15.25 one degree. So there's a slight asymmetry, uh, which I believe has to do with the way that the knife was ground originally. Uh, now there we go, 15, 2, 5, 3, 5. There's a little variation depending on how I hold the, st the stone against the blade, but we're right in the right ballpark. So we've got nice symmetry from side to side using our little tape trick.